guys, Miley Galaxy Boy here. Today we are going to be making a tier list on the AI for every character in ONAF 3. And here's the tiers we got. We got insanely difficult, pretty difficult, average, pretty easy, and insanely easy. And for the characters we got Flumpty Bumpty, Birthday Boy Blab, the Redman, the B-Val, Grogfist the Clown, the Eyesore, and Golden Flumpty. Yeah, we're just going to get started here. Starting off with Flumpty Bumpty. He is basically just every single character, but much more difficult, plus some new mechanics. He has his own knight. Jump scare is kind of creepy. Yeah, we're gonna put him at the top tier because, like, that's like what he was intended for, so we're just gonna put him up there. I haven't really tried it much, though, so, but yeah, I know it's pretty difficult. Next up, we got Birthday Boy Blam. Pretty easy. He just makes his way to you, and then you just have to, like, flash the camera at him and he will run away. I'm not going to put him at insanely easy because there's one other character that can make it way more difficult for you. Next up we got the Redman. Basically he just can go to your fire anytime and you just can't go to the fire when he's there. So yeah, it's not too difficult. It can ruin your run if you're like going to freeze up or something. He's going to go at average I think. Next up we got the B-Val. It's basically the same as Birthday Boy Blam but he just goes through the vents. And you just got a blast the camera at him. That means he's going to be in the same tier as Birthday Boy Blam. Next up, we got Grungfist the Clown. He makes his way over to you like Birthday Boy Blam. You just have to not flash the camera at him. He's the character that can make it more difficult for you to counter Blam. If he's there and Blam's there at the same time. If you wait too long, Blam jump can jump scare you. And if you blast too early, Grungfist can jump scare you. The fact that he can make everything a little more difficult and he moves a little faster. I'm gonna put him in average. Next up we got the eyesore. He just appears in the hallway and then you gotta flash your camera at him like two times. I think it can take more if you wait too long because he slowly gets closer, but I could be wrong. I don't know. I don't think he's insanely difficult, but he seems more difficult than these. So I'm gonna put him in pretty difficult. Finally we got Golden Flumpty. Very simple. He can appear on your cameras and whatever camera he's in. He'll try to blend in with it, which is kind of a cool mechanic, actually. He only jump scares you if you pull down your monitor on that specific camera, meaning that, like, you could just look around and find him and then switch to another camera before getting off. So, yeah, I'm going to put him in insanely easy. And that's it for the video. Hopefully you enjoyed. If so, make sure to subscribe, ring the bell to be notified when a new video comes out, and leave a like if you did like the video. You obviously don't have to do all of this if you don't want to. But if you want to support the channel, you can. But that's it, guys. Bye.